Hello, my name is Alexia. I'm from Mexico. I'm 23 years old and I'm studying medical engineering at the YMX. Skeletons are biomechanical systems that adapted to the structure of the body and by mechanism that perform the anatomical movements. Researchers from the university developed a upper limb rehabilitation exoskeleton with which rehabilitation therapies can be reholstered. The design of this exoskeleton was made with 3D software SOLIDWORKS and it was exported to the multibody Simulink platform. In order to simulate the movement of the exoskeleton, one of the most important factors in the design of the devices is the selection of the actors, which must have the necessary forces to be able to move each of the necessary components, that in this case is the exoskeleton itself and the patient's arm. So, the question is, how to ensure that the actors that we choose have the necessary strength and career to carry out the movements. The simulation consisted in introducing in each articulation of the exoskeleton the corresponding trajectory to be able to emulate a semicircle. When realizing this moving, the electronic factors are taken into account as the PID control of each one of the seven motors. Seven force sensors were located to determine the characteristics that had to have the motors to be able to assemble an experimental physical model.